plasma ball to excite the Bashar STA. Uh, the plasma ball is 21 inches away from the base or the, the edge base of the tetrahedron. Um, the uh, outer surface of the tetrahedron is the outer wall, wall of the capacitor. The inner wall is connected to the top of the coil and the bottom of the coil comes out the green wire. So it's a uh, coil, uh, I'm sorry, it's a capacitor as the antenna and a coil uh, underneath that uh, going to the green wire. Come in, coming into my ger germanium AC to DC converter and then there'll be, there'll be a load across there of vari various ohm ohmage and then we'll read out the voltage here and then we can convert to power. Um, now I'm going to use uh, these various loads 1k, 2k, 250k, 470k, 850k and 2 mega ohm. Um, these are the values as you read them on the resistors, not not the values in terms of a measured ohmage. So this will be plus or minus uh, 10 to 20 percent because these parts are not exact. But um, anyway, this will give us a rough idea. Um, now we'd like to know whether the power that we get from that distance is uh, linear or whether um, with less of a resistance, the power reception increases. I also wanted to make a, a special note that um, you, you want to connect the negative side of this converter to ground. So I have it connected to ground, which is basically the, uh, the, the plumbing of, of my house. Um, so we'll fire this thing up. Oh, the other thing is you want to keep this circuit uh, on the opposite side of the plasma ball. You want the plasma ball to be the closest thing to the tetrahedron with nobody in between here. If you put your hand in here or if you're sitting in here, the energy transfer is way better. Or if you had anything metallic in here. Um, I'm using 21 inches because that seems to be sort of that fuzzy area between the near field and the far field. Okay, turning this on, turning this on. Oh, what I should do is have it, it had a, the caps had a charge on it, so I'm going to short out the caps. Put the load on there again. Let it grow back. Now those uh, beeps coming to the meter are inter interesting. Those are like um, uh, little spikes or little arcs coming in and the meter is warning over voltage, but it's so rapid that it's not a big deal. Okay, I'm going to say 3.62. Okay, the, the caps are shorted out again, starting from zero, putting the 220 ohm on there. Starting from the shorted cap 
again. Now we're gonna do the 470k load. Okay, now we're gonna do the 850 kilo ohm. This is approaching a mega ohm. Okay, now we're going to do two more going. Tetrahedron is a capacitor, there's an outer surface and an inner surface. The inner surface is top, touching the top of the coil, the bottom of the coil is our antenna lead. So nothing here is grounded, it is purely acting as an antenna, coming into the AC to DC converter and, and then we're measuring. Um, so um, let me write down that final number and crunch the results.